Yesterday was not too eventful except for the fact that I met my friend. Her name is Hyunmin. We met actually on this language exchange website. It was just really great to meet her because she's around my age and she's interested in going to art school in America. And I was like, oh my gosh, like I go to Parsons. And so we met up. It was so like crazy to see her in person. And she was like, oh, like what do you feel like? I still haven't tried dim sum here in Korea. She was like, yeah, I know a good dim sum place. Like it's in Yeonnam-dong, which is like the north part of Hongdae. So we had tangsuyuk, which is that like fried pork with the orange sauce. And then she liked this like kind of spicier one called xiao something. I wish I remember the name. I was like, oh, well, like, is there anything that you like to get? And I was like, oh, like, I like to get like Shaolong Bao or like called XLV <laughs> in America. And she's like, oh, yeah, they have it. And so we got that as well. And we also had like Solmek, which is soju mixed with beer, mekju. Then we wanted to go to a dessert place. I always wanted to try like Bingsu here. I said, oh, yeah, that you know that place, Solbing. And she's like, oh, yeah, I think there's some like you're here. And we got this flavor called Enjoy Me, which is like the, I guess it's like a rice cake flavor. It's kind of savory. It has like a kosuan ma, I guess like nut sort of flavor. So if you're ever at Seolbing and you don't want to get some of the more basic flavors like chocolate, you can try Enjoy Me. I just got back from going to the CIEE office because my group actually won the scavenger hunt. Like I don't know if you remember the scavenger hunt, but that scavenger hunt that I did with that big group, we actually won. I guess like we had the most fun pictures or the nicest pictures. I went and got the prize for the scavenger hunt. This is what she showed me. It was either this one or the peach character one. As of now, as of March 18th, COVID is still pretty bad here. Like I'd say that a lot of people are getting COVID, but the regulations I feel like aren't that bad. I think that people are just tired of all the restrictions and regulations that have to follow. And I really hope that by the end of the semester, things will be more back to normal. One of my like friends, I guess, I don't know her too well, but she invited me to her like birthday get together today where we're basically gonna go to Itaewon, have dinner, go to a bar and go to a club. And there's gonna be like a bunch of other people coming. And I've never been to a bar or a club, especially not here in Korea. But I was like, sure, like I'll go, like it's no big deal. I mean, I guess I don't wanna get COVID from those places cause it's definitely easy to catch COVID there, but I'll, I'll be careful. I mean, so many exchange students here always go out to bars and clubs these days, even with COVID. And then, then they just get COVID. So yeah, I'm not planning to do that. As I said before, all the places, including bars and clubs, have to close at 11 p.m. So I'm not gonna be staying out that late and I have my friend Hannah with me. Oh, I just hope I <laughs> like keep my head on straight and not like lose control of myself or something, which I'm not going to, I'm planning not to. Oh, I guess I'll see you later tonight. Wait, I never got your guys' name. Oh, my name is Emily. I'm Emily. I'm Amelia. So, like, oh, Amelia? Yeah, surely I don't forget Emily. <laughs> when you go to the lawn for the club, make sure you have your IDs ready. Just because there's going to be a lot of people. But.
this place called Korean name is Densewang, which means like dance king. It's very a very nice professional, I guess, looking studio. Because then the soulmates, which were just other Korean students, came with us. So there was actually a little more people. And so my soulmate's name was Jooyeon. And she was so nice leading the way and we enjoyed the dance class. You probably saw the videos. I like kind of <laughs> I did my best, okay? So don't judge me. <laughs> <laughs> kind of happy that we learned it. I was anticipating a new song, like a song that recently got released, but I'm actually happy that it was Dynamite because it's easier. <laughs> Ready? Action! Woo! Bye! Bye! Bye. 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 Thank, Thank you! you. <laughs> oh, why the X cookie? We're close! Yeah. It's around here somewhere. This is where we're supposed to go, right? Yeah, yeah. I don't think they're here yet, though. Should we wait for them? I did end up getting the light stick for the Treasure concert. You can see this is Waichi. I got a light stick for $35, which these sometimes go for more in America, maybe like $40 or $50. Oh, there's something in my bag. I didn't actually see this. I didn't even look at this bag. Oh my goodness. Oh, they gave me like a little photo card. This is Yedam. Honey, you've got a big storm coming. I think that's like the only person that people know from Treasure as far as like the people that I've talked to, whether they be like Korean or not, like exchange students. So I wonder if the lady at the restaurant heard me and like gave me it or if that was just a coincidence. You can only get a sticker if you order something and it was for Jihoon's birthday event which I didn't, <laughs> I didn't know about. I feel like I'm a bad fan. We return you now to your regularly scheduled program. <laughs> I ended up getting dinner with Kang, another soulmate. Even though I don't know Kang that well, like I'm so glad that like we still went to dinner together because it was so fun. <laughs> And then afterwards we went to Tusum Cafe and had ice cream. <laughs> I'm surprised that you're interested in meeting foreign friends. Oh really? Uh, this is the uh, uh, first time to talk with foreign people, person um uh oh, you can eat it. Uh, eat it? Eat it. What is eat it? No photo. Ah, one by one? Close. I'm close. One on one. Ah, one on one. And a person by person. Like face to face. Ah, face to face. Wait, wait. I'm going to come on soil. Yeah. Okay. Wow. 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 I've never been to abroad. Wow. Wow. I can't believe that. <laughs> I hope to go abroad after soon. Oh, okay. But after soon, uh, the COVID 19 is started. So, wow. I've never had a chance. And she, she had some, something to do and she had like maybe confirmed with someone already and she kind of forgot. So we had to part ways kind of suddenly afterwards. I was walking back and then I saw that there was, I heard singing. I heard this guy singing and I heard, I saw a crowd of people. And when I first came up to like the crowd and the singer, then he was like finishing a song. So it was kind of awkward. And I just kind of was like, mm, I guess I'll wait. But they started singing this song called Shin Ho Dun in Korean, which means like traffic light. Maybe that's the name Traffic Light by Lee Woo Jin. Anyways, I really like that song. So I was like, oh yeah. They're really good. They're both really good singers, as you could probably tell. They kept performing, and it seemed like they were trying to stop, but then people kept saying, like, oh, encore, encore, like, again. And so they just kept going. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
Two police officers sort of came up behind the crowd and was just like, hey, like, you gotta stop. And then one of the guys asked, oh, like, can we just sing like one more song? And then the police officer was like, no, it's too late and too loud, so we should just stop. And so like, oh, okay, I guess we'll stop. It's called From Tail Coffee, but it's this cafe in Hongdae, I believe, where you can paint while you draw. I ended up getting an orange aid, something, and then aid is a very common thing in Korea. But yeah, I just did a koi fish because I feel like it's very aesthetically pleasing. Second, very like, you can sort of view it any way you want. Oh. <laughs> 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 